In this video, we'll be going over why and how to set the calibration and gas factors on the DECCON FP700 series ITM. Be sure to confirm with your site supervisor or operator as to what the gas and or calibration factors should be set to before starting. Furthermore, be sure that the site operator knows when you will be changing the factors and have the unit in bypass mode. After altering the unit, it is recommended that you perform a calibration on the unit as well, as to ensure that it will remain accurate. If you will be using the DECCON FP700 to detect any combustible gas other than methane, you will be changing the gas factor. If you will be calibrating with any combustible gas other than methane, you will be changing the cal factor. If you need guidance with how to determine what the gas or calibration factor should be set at, please refer to the manual that came with the unit. With the unit powered up, hold the DECCON programming magnet over PGM2 for 5 seconds. The display will read View Sensor Status across the screen. Hold the magnet over PGM2 until an arrow pointing right appears. Immediately remove the magnet. The display will read Set Auto Span Level. Hold your magnet over PGM2 until an arrow pointing right appears. Immediately remove the magnet. The display will now read Set Gas Factor. Keep the magnet over PGM2 until the display reads Set Gas Factor once more, at which point you can now flick the magnet over PGM1 to lower the gas factor and flick it over PGM2 to increase the gas factor. Once you have the gas factor to where you need it, hold the magnet over PGM2 for 5 seconds. The display will read Gas Factor Saved. The display will then read Set Gas Factor across the screen again. If you do not need to change the cal factor, you can wait 10 seconds and the unit will go back to operational mode. If you wish to change the cal factor, hold the magnet over PGM2 until an arrow pointing right appears. Release the magnet and the display will now read Set Cal Factor. Repeat the process that was done to get the new gas factor on the cal factor. Once you have finished, hold the magnet over PGM2 until it reads Cal Factor Saved. Remove the magnet and let the unit sit until it goes back to operational mode. With the gas and cal factors having been changed, proceed to complete a zero and span calibration before taking the unit off of bypass mode. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact us directly using the email provided in the description below. And if you found this tutorial useful, please like this video and subscribe to our channel to receive updates on more ProTech product tutorials.